machines really think? For decades, we've been told that human-like artificial intelligence is around the corner. I confidently expect that within 10 or 15 years, we will find emerging from the laboratories something not too far from the robot of science fiction fame. Univac, the giant electronic brain. I'm doing the talking. That's the most remarkable thing I've ever seen. We're still waiting. But scientists are making progress. Today, thinking machines can yeah. respond socially to human movement and emotion. No, you're not to do that. No. They can communicate in many of the ways that people do. Come on, give it. Assist in medical care. From mood elevating robots that respond to human touch to systems that aid in diagnosis. Have you been feeling tired lately? Yes. Can you bring your child to see the doctor? They can play soccer, kind of. Collaborate with us in the workplace. Would you like me to check his calendar to see if he had any free time later today? Yes. On Earth and in space. More on Jeopardy. Two human champions going brain to brain with a supercomputer named Watson. And recently, this language savvy machine captured the world's attention. This person is appointed by a testator to carry out the directions and requests in his will. Watson. What is executor? Right. Same category, 1600. Watson. Who is Franz Liszt? Watson. Who is the church lady? Watson. What is narcolepsy? You are right. I would have thought that the technology like this was years away, but it's here now. I have the bruised ego to prove it. We've come from this to this. How will artificial intelligence impact our lives in the future? Good evening and welcome to our program tonight, Man-Made Minds Living with Thinking Machines, or as I like to call it, Man-Made Minds Beyond the Roomba. As we saw in the video, AI has been a human obsession for much of the last century. It shows up all the time in our imaginations and now it's showing up increasingly in our daily lives. So tonight we'll explore how AI is influencing our lives already and the role of AI in the future. What humanoid skills from a robot can we expect? One of our panelists tonight, Rodney Brooks, hopes that in the near future, robots will have, get this, the social skills of a human eight-year-old, the dexterity of a six-year-old, the language skills of a four-year-old, and the object recognition of a two-year-old. In other words, soon we'll be hearing robots saying, I know you are, but what am I? <laughs> While playing rock, paper, scissors. So how far away are we from that? And how far are we from an arti artificial intelligence that can solve a new problem it hasn't been trained to solve? An AI that can be adaptive, like, like a biological system, like us. How far are we from an AI capable of autonomous creation and invention? Can machines think? How good are machines at imitating humans? We'll look for answers tonight. 